Hey y'all, what is up? Today is a very special day in the with the Griffins, not in the Griffin household. Well, maybe. Um, we're moving to a new household. It's moving day. This is so exciting. Um, we picked up the U-Haul today. Um, this morning, I originally reserved a 10-foot truck because I figured that was plenty. Um, however, they said that the 10-foot truck doesn't come with this little ramp. And the important part of this ramp is that we have a piano that we need to move into the truck. And he said, he said that the, the truck space, you know, from here to the ground is like a foot and a half. And so I was like, I'm not sure we can pick up the giant piano, the two of us, um, a foot and a half off the ground. So I upgraded to the 15 foot. We are going to load as much as possible in the back of this uh, U-Haul, which is, I mean, everything that we have, we'll have plenty of room. But then we're gonna drive to storage. We're gonna unpack there. Well, not unpack. We're gonna drive to storage. We're going to take the stuff out that needs to stay in storage because we, guys, we only have so much space in the apartment. We can't, you know, physically house everything in there. And our plan is to eventually either get a garage or storage unit at the apartment, but we are on a, a wait list, I guess. There's, there's too many people that want one and not enough units available. So for now, we're gonna keep our storage unit, maybe downgrade because we won't have as many things in there. Um, but that being said, we have like a generator. We have our, well, I don't know what we're gonna do with our bikes. <sighs> we have two Traegers. Um, we still have our dining table, which isn't going to fit. So that's all gonna stay in storage. After we go to storage, drop that stuff off. We'll bring the piano in and then what else? Oh, and the couch. So hopefully all that stuff fits. It'll fit. It'll fit. Um, as you can see, Cullen already put the bed frame in the truck and I'm going to need to help him with the mattress. And we're just going to play Tetris and strategically pack the truck as much as possible. Like I said, um, efficiently that way when we're in storage, we can, you know, do all the things, but whew, I'm kind of tired already, but we can do it. We've moved several times before. This is not our first rodeo. It's just a, come at an unfortunate time, but we're excited to get it all in. So we'll bring you along with us today. How are we doing, Only Bear? Hmm? Are we excited to go into a new place? Huh? Are we excited? I still don't comprehend what's happening. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I really don't think she gets it yet. You don't think so? I know mean, she's really, really smart, but I don't think she gets it yet. Yeah. Yeah. Well, this is what we have left. This is not our bedroom. Um, we have our mattress, which is actually really heavy. So we have a purple mattress right now and it's made out of like gel stuff. It's very comfortable, but it definitely requires some heavy lifting, mainly because it's, you know, so flimsy. Um, we have our corduroy, which I'm currently washing the outer layer and then some clothes. This is actually padding, which is kind of funny. Um, some clothes in here and these boxes and then just these clothes hanging that's all we have left here in the bedroom other than that we have our tv which is right here and some paradise adventure co boxes the actual product that we have to take with us and then our bikes, generator, the things that are outside. We're actually moving quite quickly. Um, we did make a trip yesterday, so that was helpful without the U-Haul. Just whatever we could fit in the car, we just went, and I've been trying to unload as we go. That way, well, not unload. I've been trying to organize as we go. Cohen's been unloading, I've been organizing, so it wouldn't seem too overwhelming. And when we bring like the couch and the piano today, um, it won't be, there won't be stuff all over the place. So fingers crossed that works out. But let's show you what the truck looks like now. Cullen's been going to work. I already filled the car too. So the car's full of um, like the stuff from the kitchen, um, orders from Paradise Adventure Co that have to be shipped out today. And yeah, so, okay. Yeah, we got a giant truck, y'all. Look at this, okay. Ooh, 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 ooh. So currently we have the bed frame and then all these boxes. So it's really not a lot in here yet, but we have plenty of room 
four things. So I'm sure we will leave this space open if possible for the piano um, because it's about five and a half feet. Um, and then the couch will be able to fit in here as well. The only issue with this bed frame is that we got it, um, we got it off Amazon, which is, is really nice and affordable. It's less than $200, I think. Um, but we're trying to take it apart and the screws are stripping. So we're just moving it in one piece and hoping for the best. So obviously it fits. I don't know how we're going to get it into the apartment complex easily. Uh, Cullen moved this by himself though. I literally had nothing to do with the actual moving of it. He just picks it up and moves it. The only issue I find that we might have is that we have to move through a hallway. And so I don't, I don't know how that's gonna go. But I guess we're gonna find out. I told you to take a little bit of Tetris move. Um, but Collins is an expert at Tetris, so we've moved the bed, frame, the mattress over there. The TV is actually under here. Um, all of our boxes for Paradise Adventure Co. are up here. And so we still have some things, but it kind of gives us a little more room to play with. And then that way, when we get to the storage unit, we'll just move some things around. It shouldn't be that big of a deal, but it's coming along. I'm tired, y'all. This is why we CrossFit, though, because if we didn't CrossFit, I'm not sure we'd be able to do this by ourselves just saying all the lifting all the back and forth i'm already breathing heavy so functional fitness hi y'all say hi Oli bear buckle up safety first we are on our way to the storage unit technically i'm on my way to the post office and then to grab smoothies and then to the storage unit but cone's going straight there um it is almost three o'clock it's 2 57 so it took almost three hours to load the truck and clean you know make sure that we didn't leave a mess but i'm pretty sure we have everything which means we don't have to come back to the house which is really nice it's very exciting so i'm going to drive there safely without filming Always gonna sit here and be a good girl. Yes, you're such a good girl. And um, we will check in at the storage unit because I can't wait to see what that looks like. Hi, how's it going? I'm tired. Yeah, I'm tired too. Guys, this is what our storage unit looks like, which is unfortunate because I forgot that we had all this stuff. Um, also, I just carried these things. They're kind of heavy. Oh, nice. So I'm gonna say- Ooh, another one. Another one what? Oh yeah, we have like three of those. I'm gonna say we need to get this couch out and then the piano and then anything else just stays here. It's all the way in the back. Yeah. Um, everything else just stays here and we can get it another time because one, we don't have room for it. And two, I don't think we have room for it, if that makes sense, so. Also, there's like a million people at the storage unit today, which is so weird because every time we come here, there's nobody here, right? Anytime, like maybe one car, but there were like six cars when Cullen got here. There was another U-Haul that pop popped up when we were outside. I'm just like, what the heck is happening today? So apparently everyone needs the storage units, which is unfortunate for us, but we're gonna move some of the stuff and always, always in the car. Can I bring her in here? Yeah, okay. Bring her in here. Don't ask anybody, just bring her in. Cool, she's coming in. We made it to the piano. My baby. All right, so unfortunately, I think we still have to move all of this stuff in order to get that out because it's a nice little squeeze. And last time we moved it, we both had to be on an end, so. <sighs> so. I had planned before moving out to come to the storage unit and like go through the stuff, right? And we did attempt to do that one time, but the problem, problem um, with most of this stuff is that it's either our memories from trips or um, stuff from our childhood or from our wedding. And I don't really know what to do with it. I don't want to get rid of it. So I would like to keep it. Um, I have books from, from, school but it's like music you know because i went to music school and so i don't want to like i said i don't want to get rid of it and therefore we have all of this stuff but the good news is that the piano is free and we're going to try to move it now because cullen is back from doing the couch how'd that go uh, harder than I thought. why didn't you call me i don't know 
What the? What are you doing? <laughs> you look like a, a legit walking corduroy. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> this is too funny. I just gotta keep recording until you get there. <laughs> I did it. You did it. <sighs> Baby girl, I'm so happy for you. Look at you, you are queen of the house. You have found your own spot with no interruptions, with no delays, with no barking, no other people messing with you, no other pups messing with you. Look at you, you're living it up. You have laid up from on this couch, to this bed, to that blanket over there in the corner. This house is yours, are you excited? I'm really happy for you. I'm also proud of you for sticking it out. For that long, you've really matured, and we love you. We'll have to give you a gift. Paradise Crew, let us know what we should gift her for being such a good pup, such a good girl. Let us know what we should gift her down in the comment section below, and we'll, we'll go figure that out and give her something special, maybe a, a pup cup or something. You're knackered, right, Oli Bear? She's like, I'm ready to go to sleep. Get this camera out of my face. All right, bye, Mama. We'll, we're going to keep packing. We'll see you in a bit. I decided to come back to the storage unit, one, to bring this back, but we had a couple boxes left over, so I think we're finally done, y'all. It's 9.08, so we're going to get some Chipotle. Y'all, this is the latest I've stayed up in a long time, and I'm really sleepy, but we did it. We got moved in. It doesn't look pretty right now. But I'm in my own bed, in our own apartment. Isn't that exciting, honey? It is. So we're going to go to bed, and then I'm going to deal with organizing tomorrow. But thanks for watching. Thanks for your love and your prayers and support, because I couldn't have done it without y'all. So I'll talk for now. So we're actually moving right. So the only issue that I find that we might have is that we have to navigate the stupid plane. I'm just not gonna yell. I'm not gonna yell. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I almost spit the bread out. <laughs>